So you love Ghibli, you are faulty, and you can't live without porridge. But if like me, you are a little sick of endless reruns of classics on UK Gold, then this is the article for you. It's easy to think that they just don't make them like they used to, but with so many channels producing top quality comedy, there is as much great new stuff as there has ever been. In fact, there are upwards of 30 British comedy shows in production ready to hit the small screen next year. Here's a roundup of a few. Greatest Stand-Up Comedians Channel 5 If you are a bit of a comedy geek like me then you are probably a bit of a fan of those Channel 5 list programs. It's a guilty pleasure, but we all do it. The latest offering is the top 50 greatest stand-up comedians of all time in this three-hour special. Spending Dave's Money Dave Well this is a new take of Brewster's Millions. Celebrity duos jetted to far-flung places and challenged to spend up to £10.000 of Channel Dave's money in just 24 hours. It may sound easy, but our hapless profligates, face strict rules, can only gamble away 10% on rash bets and face forfeits if they keep even one penny. Hank Zipster CBBC, not all great British comedy shows have to be for adults. A news kids comedy series starring Henry Winkler, now what's there not to like about that? It's inspired by the book series Hank Zipser, the world's greatest underachiever, written by the great man himself. The series promises to be fast-paced and funny as it follows 12-year-old Henry Hank Zipser, a smart and resourceful boy with a unique take on things, for Hank has dyslexia and when problems arise, he deals with them in his own special way, putting him on a direct collision course with his teachers and parents. Tommy Cooper, not like that, like this ITV, you must check out this feature film about legendary comedian Tommy Cooper. Not only great subject matter, but written by written by Simon Men behaving badly, night and starring David Threlfall as the classic comic. The script focuses on the dilemma the much-loved comedian faced when he fell in love with assistant Mary Kay Tommy, was married to Gwen, whom he adored and affectionately nicknamed Doug, but was unable to choose between the two. The affair lasted 17 years and was only ended with Tommy's untimely death in 1984. Puppy Love BBC 4, a show set around the world-based dog training classes, now that's got my interest. This canine-based offering comes from BAFTA award-winning getting on actresses Joe Scanlon and Vicky Pepperdine. According to Andy, this series both celebrates and sends up the deeply held relationship between dogs and their owners. Bring it on. So that's it, my roundup of the British comedy shows that you can't afford to miss. Happy viewing.